still reeling from the death and destruction caused by tropical cyclone Anna last week, Madagascar prepared for another dangerous cyclone to hit the country. Storm in less than two weeks. Wind gusts up to 250 km per hour and wave heights up to 15 meters are predicted. Many people have been relocated to shelters, and local authorities fear that landslides and floods could leave tens of thousands more homeless. Storm Anna caused widespread destruction when it hit the South African island nation last month, killing 55 people. Cyclone Batsirai made landfall around 20 hundred hours. In just an hour, about 27,000 people were forced to leave their homes, according to the country's disaster management agency. There were reports of power outages, destroyed homes and downed trees. The wind is terrible. I have never experienced anything like this. The waves are very high, said Kanitra Rairazoa, a resident of Mananjari, a coastal town near where the storm hit. Further down the coast, 200 people crammed into one room in a concrete building in the city of Vatamandri, hoping the relatively strong structure would protect them. The city is running out of clean water after a utility company turned off the supply ahead of the storm, raising concerns about disease caused by dirty water. The UN World Food Programme has prepared food stocks for distribution to those in need, and some people have already been evacuated. The UN put the rescue plane on standby. Experts fear that Cyclone Batsarai could be even more powerful than Storm Anna, which also hit Mozambique, Malawi, and Zimbabwe. Heavy rains and high waves pose a threat of flash floods as this oil is already soaked with water. 